Hello friends! Today, I am at your service with a new report of important projects that are going on in Sarpol and Kandahar provinces. Let's take a look at these projects and their effects on the lives of people in these areas. The construction of a new channel at the cost of $210,000 has started in Sarpol province. This project was launched to improve agricultural infrastructure and facilitate access to water for local farmers and is scheduled to be completed within seven months. The said canal will be built in a standardized way and after its completion, about 1,500 acres of agricultural land in several villages will benefit from the water of this canal. In addition to improving agricultural production, this project has provided new job opportunities for local people. Officials emphasize that the implementation of this project will not only increase agricultural productivity, but also improve the quality of life of the residents of the region. Some local residents welcoming this project have demanded the continuation of such projects to improve the agricultural and water supply infrastructure in Sarpol province. Sarpol, which is surrounded by agricultural lands and vast gardens, needs standard projects in the water supply sector. The successful implementation of this project can be an effective example for further development of infrastructure in this province and play an important role in the development of its agricultural sector. This project is part of a broader effort underway in collaboration with international organizations to improve irrigation systems and support farmers in Afghanistan. In Kandahar province, a 2.5 kilometers long irrigation canal was put into operation in Miwan district, and at the same time, the construction of a new canal started in another area. This canal, which was built with financial assistance from the United Nations Development Program and cost $106,000, will play an important role in reducing water loss and improving the irrigation of hundreds of acres of agricultural land. In the same ceremony, officials announced that a new project called Panjab Canal has been started with a cost of $852,000. This canal, will be built with a length of four kilometers, and after completion, it can cover parts from Kandahar to Panjvai district. It is expected that this project will directly and indirectly help 19,000 residents of the region and have a positive impact on agricultural production and the economy of the region. Local officials emphasize that with the implementation of such projects, the management of water resources and prevention of water wastage will be improved and agriculture will be mechanized in this area. These projects are part of the general plans for the development of water infrastructure throughout Afghanistan, and agricultural production in Kandahar and neighboring areas is expected to increase with these measures. The construction of a new town and market has started in Sarpol province in Sayad district on an area of 50 acres of land. This project, which is implemented with the aim of developing local infrastructure and creating commercial and residential opportunities for the people of the region is part of the reconstruction and economic development plans in this province. At the opening ceremony of this project, local officials announced that this settlement and market can have a significant impact on economic prosperity and improving the living conditions of residents. It is expected that this project will create new job opportunities for local workers and traders, and also help the development of small and medium businesses. This action is part of the development programs that the Afghan government officials also emphasized that the creation of such projects not only helps to improve commercial and residential infrastructure, but also can reduce the migration of people to bigger cities and attract more investments to these areas. Similar projects are also being implemented in different parts of Sarpol province, which include the construction of schools, health centers, and water supply infrastructure. The implementation of such plans is part of a comprehensive local development program designed to promote public welfare, improve access to basic services, and increase agricultural production. This town and market will be built with a focus on sustainable development, and in the future, it can become an important business center for the residents and surrounding villages. It is expected that with the completion of this project, the living and economic conditions in the region will improve significantly. In the last two months, 35 kilometers of roads have been repaired and graveled in Sayad district of Sarpol province. This project was implemented following the damage caused by the recent floods to the roads. The restoration of this road, 
which extends between the villages of Piste Mazar and Chateau, was implemented in order to improve access and reduce the problems of commuting of the residents. The local authorities announced that this project was carried out with the cooperation of the 4th Brigade of the 209th Alphath Corps and with the financial support of the local administration of Sarpol Province, with a cost of 3 million Afghanis. The purpose of this plan was to improve transportation infrastructure and facilitate communication between villages for the people of this region. The local residents welcomed the implementation of this project and asked the government to take measures to tar the roads in the future. This project plays an important role in facilitating the passage of vehicles and livestock and helps to improve people's daily lives. This action is part of the government's wider efforts to rebuild damaged roads in Sarpol province, and similar projects are planned to be implemented in other districts as well. These renovations will not only improve access roads, but also reduce future flood damage. Thank you for watching.